What is up everybody? Welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. I just came back from visiting a friend's island to sell my turnips on. I made kind of bit of a profit. Not too much, not too shabby. But I did get some rot I did get some flowers that I have been dying to get. But before I go and plant them, however, there's a special event. Leaf is in my town. Hey ya, hey ya, and welcome! What should I call you, friend? Did you say soap? How do a muppet like you get past training? Anyways, I'm Leaf. I heard that my good pal Timmy started a shop here, so I thought I'd pay him a visit. Timmy told me that this was a desert island before you moved here. What a happy adventure. I bet you're up to your ear holes and weeds when you first arrived. But the island itself is a blank canvas that you can paint however you like. I hope some of the rare flower seeds and shrubs that I brought with me will be featured in your final masterpiece. Uh, well, I know what a shrub is, but how about you explain, Leaf? Oh, what a happy coincidence. I was just thinking to myself that shrubs are often too overlooked. Shrubs are kind of like little trees. Or are they more like flowers, but bigger. However, however you see them, what matters is that they bloom seasonally and add something special to a garden. By the way, today I'm selling the happiest shrub I know, the Isole. And lucky for us, it's currently in season, so we don't have to wait to appreciate its lovely blooms. Anyway, meeting you has been a true pleasure. I hope to see you again soon, Soap. Leaf reminds me of Bob Ross. <laughs> Just his manner of talking. What a happy little coincidence. This canvas is yours to paint, to your heart's content. It's definitely something that he will say. <gasps> no. <laughs> Buy them both, please. I'll take that. Yes. Oh, but I got red roses in my town available. <laughs> yes. Sweet. Thank you, Leaf. I hope he's going to have some more roses, but I'm going to make my town a very beautiful and nature friendly. Yes, yes, yes. Red roses, that's exactly what I need. Because red roses makes black roses. And they make golden roses once you water them. You gotta do what makes you happy. I'll be here if you change your mind. Thank you, Bob Ross. <laughs> oh, hey, a balloon. So, uh, I just got a message here. Uh, hold on, hold on a real tick here. This is actually the uh, first time that... I actually have a visitor in my town. Okay, so to those who don't know how to get friends in your town, you go to Orville, hit visitors. <laughs> well, yeah, you, you press visitors, press online play, unless you're playing locally. Connect the internet. So you have the choice of inviting all your friends, only your best friends, or if you want to secure it really good. Use a dodo code and it is randomly generated, so don't worry. This looks like a good spot to be planting some roses. I, I am waiting for my plants to grow some more. I also reorganized my orchards over here it's a little misaligned but that's all right but over here looks like a good spot to be planting some new flowers for my town so I hope you guys are having a good time hope you're all having a good nature day here in Animal Crossing it's always fun when there's new events Yes, there we go. I am probably doing this wrong, but that's okay. I'm surprised that Leaf is not selling fertilizers. But I guess since this island was abandoned, it's more than likely rich in fertilizer. Especially from the minerals blown in from the sea. And 
the islands were after all volcanic wastelands before before they moved away from the hot spots or at least that's how it is in Hawaii anyway alright roses those are lilies 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 roses okay Gosh, I can't wait until I can get some golden roses soon. Golden roses are the most beautiful roses in the game. Let me tell you right now. And the best thing about them, they never wilt. Yes, there we are. I'll sort the uh, flowers out once they are fully grown, but for now I'm just putting them down. Okay, over here looks like a good place. This will give me a great opportunity to decorate my villagers' houses with different types of flowers. So I'm happy about this. I'm just putting them down because so that way when they grow, I can resort them myself. But the important thing right now is to get them out and then grow. Alright. Now I have some cosmos and I have red cosmos over here so I'm gonna go put it over here and then they can I can breed these flowers white cosmos And I believe I have yellow cosmos? Oh no, I have white mums. <laughs> white mums. <laughs> Funny. Okay, uh, I have yellow ones over here. Where are they? There they are. Alright. Oh yeah, I gotta get that money tree first. This is all like some uh, nature themed episode here. Just doing good things for the environment. Uh, let's see what this tree over here gives. Not bad. I have a lot, so I don't really care. I have no idea why, but... After I paid off the loan for the house, money and bells in particular, they no longer have much of a reason to be used. They have reasons, of course, because... I have to move my houses, I have to move houses in order to decorate my town and whatnot. I guess there's also purchasing things from Nook Cranny, from Nook Cranny and the Able Sisters and the Nook Shopping, but eh, nah, I'm not really much of a fashion person. Like this suit that I'm wearing, I came up with it on my own and it's actually really horrible. Because this is very mismatched. Because I'm wearing, wearing slacks with a business suit. Isabel also mentioned at the very beginning that there is special limited edition nature day activities. If I plant three shrubs, I'm going to get a lot of points. So that, that, that's rather good for me. I'm happy about that. Ooh. Good stuff. I bet Barrett from Final Fantasy 7 would be one to play this game. And he would be like, Can't you hear the earth? I'm gonna put some more flowers to make her night to make her breathe nice and good. And then Cloud who reluctantly brought this game because Aria told him, 
Cloud, buy this game! It's gonna be so good! He just puts over the chat, get help. <laughs> How would I get? I got a long round table. Also, I'm going to be doing a Smash video later on. I mean to tell you the good- Oh, what's the good news, Bladders? Thanks to your hard work and the support of Lock Lock, the museum can now display more specimens than ever before, thus I'm considering fine works of art. So the update is that Red, the Kitsune, will be coming into town and he sells artwork. Except that his artwork sometimes can be forged and it can be fake. And he can charge you absurd amount of money for it. Oh, look at this big one over here! Yeah, I'll take the Papa Bear. There's some new tools over here. These ones last way more longer than what I'm crafting. So that's good. There's actually a glitch going on right now where if you have more than one particular if you have more than one of these shrubs in here and they're different it will crash the game and it will erase your data so I have to be very careful about what I buy here so I'm just gonna buy one at a time I actually did not visit the camping site yet. Oh, it's another fox. I mean, it's another. Wo it's another. Um, it's another uh, wolf. Howdy. I'm just sticking a claim for a bit and join the camping life. Be seeing you. Harumph. I play a game. Get my hourglass. Sure. Yeah. What's the rules? Oh man, really? You only have two options for red or black. <laughs> really? Uh. So I think that about covers it. Okay, I got some shrubs planted over here. <laughs> Look at that poor one over there. He just. I haven't talked to my duck yet. Good to see you, sunflower. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, they uh, they call me Sunflower now. It's always a treat. Get trying to talk to you. Wow, oh, wow. Yes, thank you everybody for watching. Come back next time. I'm going to be doing some Smash videos. Another classic mode. I'm not sure if I'll be doing the online because unless it's with friends or if I find a good arena, uh, it's gonna be messy. The Elite Smash is. It's better. The online experience in Elite Smash is better, but I find that. Arenas are a lot more stable in terms of connection. Especially since the fact that people are home now, so it's kind of like hogging out the internet and whatnot. But yeah, until the next episode, everybody. Stay fresh and have yourselves a good day.